This is Li Zheng, licensed acupuncturist and herbalist. Today I'd like to talk about autoimmune disease and how acupuncture can make the autoimmune disease go into remission. Why women tend to develop autoimmune disease during menopause or after they deliver the baby? One of the new theory is about a progesterone deficiency. Progesterone has the function of balancing immune function and if progesterone is not balanced with estrogen then the immune function tend to be out of balance. So we have estrogen, progesterone and estrogen stimulate the immune function. Progesterone kind of balance the estrogen effect and during menopause the ovarian function is gradually declining so less and less progesterone is producing. That create a condition called estrogen dominance. And when estrogen is out of balance with the progesterone, it stimulates the immune system to produce autoantibody. And during this situation, if a woman have not sufficient sleep, which stimulate their sympathetic nerves, making the immune function hyperactive, or they drink too much coffee, that also stimulate the sympathetic nerves, or they simply eat too much sugar, create the inflammation in their tissues. So when immune function produce autoantibody attack their joint, then they will have rheumatoid arthritis. If it attack the colon, then it will be a Crohn's disease. And if autoantibody attack the nerves, then it will be neuropathy. And there is also lupus, which can damage your kidney, skin, your joint, and also the thyroid problem, Hashimoto's disease. This is all related with imbalanced immune function. And how acupuncture can help this condition? So far, medication cannot cure the autoimmune disease. But combining the acupuncture and the medication, we can let autoimmune disease go into remission or it will slow down the progression. So acupuncture can enhance your adrenal gland function. That will produce more progesterone. When the ovarian function is declining, adrenal gland can still produce a little bit of progesterone which help to balance the immune function especially when menopause women tend to have estrogen dominance this little bit of progesterone from adrenal gland plays a very important role and also adrenal gland can produce cortisone which is a universal drug for fight inflammation and autoimmune disease so Acupuncture brings the energy to your adrenal gland. In Chinese medicine, we call it kidney function. That will help to balance the immune function and make the autoimmune disease go into remission. Second, acupuncture can instantly reduce your stress. And stress hormone cortisol share the same precursor with progesterone. So more stress less progesterone and more imbalance of the immune system. Third, acupuncture can also enhance ovarian function. So when the ovarian function is declining, acupuncture can make ovarian function declining slow down so the body have the chance to rebalance the estrogen and the progesterone. Also, acupuncture relax your whole body and the mind so you stop thinking. You have more balanced the nervous system. And the more balanced the nervous system, the more balanced the immune function. Fifth, acupuncture can speed up the circulation in local tissue. That will help to clear up the inflammation. So the damage of tissue can repair also, acupuncture can help you sleep deeper. During deep sleep, 
more growth hormone is produced and the tissue will be repaired more efficiently. Last, acupuncture can improve your digestion. So your body can produce more balanced chemicals, more relaxing hormones like GABA, serotonin. When you are more relaxed, your immune function is more balanced. So less autoantibody produced, more tissue repairment. Then the autoimmune disease can go to remission.